guys, this is Diva Lens, and I'm going to do a quick review on um, Bubba Gump Restaurant at Universal. It's at it's on City Walk, and uh, that has been on my uh, list of things to do for years, and this year was my first time going there, so I'm just going to share my experience, and it's actually funny. So, we show up, um, they ask your name, and... They give you a buzzer. No, I'm sorry. They don't give you a buzzer. You give your number and they text you when it is time to come back to the podium and then your server will take you to your table. So we just went in the gift shop for a few minutes. We purchased a couple of things and then uh, my phone uh, received the text message. So I went out there and our server took us to our table and we looked at the menu my daughter ordered uh, a drink we both did and then her appetizers were hush puppies which to my surprise my son actually liked and I got the lobster uh, mac and cheese now it's funny because I mentioned to a lady on the bus that I was going there for dinner this night and she had previously been there maybe the night before I think she said and she said the mac and cheese um, didn't sit well on her stomach because she's like the craft macaroni and cheese the creamy one she's that kind of girl and that this one didn't sit right on her stomach so um, when I got to the restaurant the guy suggested that so being I also wanted to taste that I just went on and uh, tried it uh, what I can say is I understand what what she meant um, it's kind of a maybe an oily base like it's not as creamy as you would think but it was it was still good I mean I ate it uh, the hush puppies were good I tried those and like I said to my surprise my son um, enjoyed those now for dinner our entrees were uh, he got the chicken finger meal and it came with some fruit and jello and uh, my daughter and I um, lobster stuffed uh, shrimps now if you've watched any of my other reviews you would know I'm one of those salt sensitive people and I could not finish this dish I almost wanted to send it back after the first shrimp because I can taste the salt I mean it was a lot and I knew had I eaten my whole uh, entree I would have had a, a pressure headache the next day so I, I didn't I didn't want to waste my money so I ate a few um, but I, I didn't eat them all diamond said they were delicious and for the most part they were good they were just extremely salty to me um, I will go back there but I will not order that or I would ask for uh, a salt free option but uh, yes and um, I am on a Disney I have a Disney Facebook page it is called Diva Lens Does Disney and so I um, did my check-in saying I was there and one of my uh, friends on there we're all friends on there uh, one of my friends on there said that she had been there and that one of the waiters uh, made her mom feel extra extra special for her birthday and when she showed me the picture the guy was actually there he wasn't my waiter but he was there so uh, I asked my waiter if um, I can speak to him when he gets uh, a second and I, I showed him um, the picture in the comments that she had said and he was so happy to see that he had made somebody's day and they actually remembered but it was just funny that I would be there and uh, you know we knew that and and I could uh, show him that that comment so yes um, but the meal was great and then for dessert we went for the uh, the trio so we got a red pudding strawberry shortcake and um, looks like some kind of brownie with ice cream so um again I never taste bread pudding before but this year this trip was the first time I tasted it and 
that was good the strawberry shortcake was good and we didn't really eat too much of the brownie it was like a chocolate chip cookie with um, chocolate drizzled on it with uh, vanilla ice cream on top but I guess by then between the macaroni and cheese uh, and the drink and the bread pudding I, I was kind of full by the time I got to the brownie thing but uh, the service was beautiful it was it was nice um, just if you didn't know you can pay there with a universal gift card which I did and I leave a tip on my uh, debit card but there you have to uh, purchase something on the debit card you just can't uh, put the tip on so he um, gave me a refill on the drink for 99 cents so he charged the 99 cents to my card and then his tip so that was that um, we had a wonderful time we will go back there again because I want to try something else uh, other than the lobster stuffed shrimp because of the salt issue but other than that it was great they had the dancing shrimp outside <laughs> when we showed up I asked my kids if they wanted to take a picture of him and I guess they were like uh, thrown off that there was a shrimp uh, dancing so they both declined so I just took a quick video of him uh, outside of the restaurant but yeah it was cute uh, the service was wonderful and we will go back there so again uh, I will be bringing you some more reviews uh, like and subscribe and everyone enjoy your beautiful day. Bye.